Hey guys, in this video we're going to do a quick unboxing video of your Microchip 2 to show you what's inside the box as well as a quick overview of the product. So to start out you want to grab your box and go ahead and pull out this black tab at the bottom front. Just like so. Next you can go ahead and pop open the hood revealing your Microchip. Now first things first you want to grab your user manual and you want to take it and read it. It only takes a few minutes and you'll learn so many things about the do's and don'ts, you'll be ready to go in just a couple minutes. So definitely read that user manual. Moving forward, underneath the user manual, you'll find your thumb screw for connecting your GoPro to the L bracket, a wrist strap, which can be optionally used and connected to the bottom of the handle. And lastly, some clear plastic shims which hopefully you won't be needing, and I'll explain when you would later in this video. So, now let's grab the piece de resistance, the microchip. Starting from the bottom, you have your quarter 20 threaded hole where you can connect your wrist strap. Next, you have your handle, which you'll be rotating in order to rotate your camera. Next, the shafts and twist locks. Now, when you go to extend your microchip, be sure to only twist these about a half of a turn. It's all it needs to free them up to be extended. Now, back to those plastic shims. In the event that you did over loosen a twist lock, and there's a video that I'll link to down below, you will actually need those plastic shims. And again, hopefully it doesn't come to that. Just don't over loosen the twist locks and you'll be fine. Next, we have the head unit, which has the locking screw, which can be used to tighten your L bracket in any position. Lastly, we have the L bracket itself and the locking nut. These two are used together to secure your camera, and also the L bracket can be used to switch between pan, which it was just in, and tilt. So, it's as simple as that. Your microchip is ready to be used, so have fun panning, tilting, and getting some awesome footage. And that's it for now, so happy filming. 